On day one, we travelled from Bagdogra to Gangtok, and beach mein humne ek riverbed explore kiya tha. Lekin jab tak hum Gangtok pahunche, tab tak raat ho chuki thi. So we just explored the MG road and went back to our hotel, Brothers Guest House, which was a nice stay. Day two began with a very long car ride. Our plan was to go from Gangtok to Nathula Pass, then go to Baba Harbhajan Singh Temple, and finally spend some time next to the Songo Lake on our way back to Gangtok. रस्ते में हमें काफी ट्रैफिक मिला लाइन से बहुत सारी गाड़ियां टूरिज्म के लिए निकली थी तो सारे चेक पोस्ट पे काफी वेटिंग करना पड़ा बट अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट द रोड जर्नी वॉज वंडरफुल बीच बीच में हम एक दो व्यू पॉइंट्स पे भी रुके एंड ऑफ कोर्स फूड ब्रेक के लिए भी रुके थे ये कितना सही लग रहा है यार That is a Sneha, and she's going to Nathula Pass right now. We are going to Nathula Pass. <laughs> she is going. To... It was a long car drive, but the views were incredible throughout. It was the first time that we started getting some glimpses of snow during this second trip, and it looked wonderful. As we started climbing higher and higher, the mountains became snowier, the weather started getting colder, and we. Five tourists from Mumbai were mesmerized by the sight of the snow-clad mountains. And not just snow-clad mountains, there were frozen lakes too. It was all looking just amazing. But we didn't stop anywhere. We just kept going higher and higher into the mountains until we finally reached the Nathula Pass at the India-China border. Hi everyone. We are at uh, Nathula Pass. आगे आई डोंट थिंक हम रिकॉर्डिंग कर सकते हैं या हम कुछ भी फोटो ले सकते हैं सो वी विल गो अ देर एट द टॉप एंड मैं आके आप लोगों को बताऊंगा कि वो कैसा था एंड द व्यू फ्रॉम ओवर हेयर इज जस्ट जस्ट टू अमेजिंग इट्स रियली कोल्ड एंड आई थिंक हम मिड मार्च में आए हैं मिड अर्ली मार्च में एंड दे स्नो एवरी वेयर दे स्नो लिटरली एवरी वेयर लाइक माइल्स एंड माइल्स अराउंड यू कैन सी द स्नो आई जस्ट शो यू द स्नो It was an amazing experience although we did not go right up to the border for two reasons. Pehla reason ye tha ki we stood in the line for 20 minutes but still had no hope of getting in without waiting for another hour or so. And second, waha photography nahi kar sakte the. So we decided to make it to the other two points before we got too late. Oh and if you've been enjoying this video do hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. And ab hum apne next stop pe ja rahe hain. I think I'll climb down from over here. So we are walking back down from the Nathula Pass, and I'm going to the car, and we'll go to the car till we reach the next stop. Next stop, we'll go. How did you feel? Tell me. What did you feel? Very good. So it was Neha's first experience. Yeah, it was my first experience. It was unexpected because I was not expecting snow. So I don't know if you guys, if you guys can see it on camera, but there's this halka sa snowfall happening right now. And वहाँ पीछे you can see the storm coming. We resumed our road trip to Baba Harbhajan Singh Temple and the views. Oh, the views! They were simply incredible. चारों तरफ पहाड़, बर्फ, frozen lakes and narrow roads that kept meandering through the massive Himalayan mountains. It all looked so aesthetic. एंड क्योंकि क्लाउड्स वगैरह आ गए थे एंड वेदर थोड़ा स्टॉर्मी हो गया था तो सब कुछ डबल एस्थेटिक हो चुका था वी कैप ड्राइविंग लिसनिंग टू म्यूजिक एडमायरिंग द व्यूज एंड सून रीच द बाबा हरभजन सिंह टेम्पल हम नथुला पास से डायरेक्टली बाबा हरभजन श्राइन पे आए हैं एंड आई एम जस्ट ट्राइंग टू फाइंड अ व्यू पॉइंट जहाँ से मैं आप लोगों को व्यू दिखा सकूँ इट्स इट्स जस्ट मैग्निफिस ये वाला थोड़ा वैलीज के बीच में है एज यू कैन सी दिल्स ऑन ऑल फोर साइड एंड इट्स इट्स जस्ट इट्स इट्स इनक्रेडिबल इट्स इनक्रेडिबल एंड आई एम जस्ट क्लाइमिंग अप सम स्टेप्स टू रीच द व्यू पॉइंट जहाँ पे कुछ लोग है आई शो यू गाइज द व्यू फ्रॉम थे इट्स नाइस विंडी इट्स वेरी 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 एक्सट्रीमली कोल्ड लुक एट द मैग्निफिस ऑल अराउंड जस्ट लुक एट द व्यू Just look at the view, man. Just look at the view. 
We spent only about 20 to 25 minutes at that point since we had started really late in the morning and we still had to visit Somgo Lake. So we were back in the car and on our way to the Somgo Lake. We enjoyed some more beautiful views during the drive and soon we were at Lake Somgo which like everything else was frozen in ice. And jab hum waha pahunche to achanak se everything was covered in fog for a while. This looks just so amazing. I have a frozen lake beneath me and uske peeche mountains hone chahiye the but I can't see anything and you can see that I can't see anything. It's full foggy, it's full cloudy, it's super cold but it's worth it. We waited here for 10-15 minutes but uh, the weather didn't get cleared up and we can't see the mountains at all. And now it's more foggy, it's going on, it's going on, it's going on. And I can see a yak. Yak. Yak, yak. Yak. This small piece of abandoned hut looks nice. It looks aesthetic. And I've reached somewhere over here. I don't even know where I am, but I've reached over here. And that is the sun. It's white. And um, there are some people doing a yak ride over there. I'm just hoping that this fog will get And we can see the massive, huge mountains. Oh, it's just so crazy. Finally, fog is clear out. Hui hai. And you can see the other side of the lake. And it is just, just incredible. We had to wait through the fog for a good half an hour. But once it cleared up, the views were simply incredible and thode thode sunset hues bhi aa chuke the tab tak which was just amazing to see and sunset pe din khatam ho gaya to kya abhi to la chain la chong pelling sab explore karna baki hai so subscribe and i will see you in the next episode of the sikkim travel series